Hey guys, Ian here. Just wanted to talk a little bit today about why uh, for my business we only do boat charters and why we don't do boat rentals. We provide experiences. I don't want to be someone who just provides boat rentals. I want to provide people with experiences on the lake that are great all around, super memorable, and keeps them wanting to come back. So. I would rather take a family out and take them tubing, help teach them how to water ski, maybe work on their wake surfing skills, um, you know, go out for a pontoon cruise, whatever it may be. I would rather do our best to show them a good time than have them go out, have problems, and have to charge them for messing something up when really they didn't even know better in the first place. Um, that's just not how I want to do things. By doing this and providing experiences as opposed to just a service like rentals, for example, we're also able to charge quite a bit more. By providing an experience, my, you know, boat that's worth $20,000 or $30,000 or whatever it may be is now bringing in more revenue and going to be more profitable than if that same boat was just being rented out for four hours at a time or a day at a time to a stranger. So we bring value by taking a lot of those worries away from people that they might experience with the boat rental. For my lake that I'm on, it's pretty small. Um, if I were to start renting out boats and have inexperienced people running boats around, I know inevitably there'd be problems and higher chance of people possibly getting into an accident and stuff like that. And I know that it would uh, really just piss off those on the lake and I wouldn't blame them one bit. For where we're at, we're a very small business. It's a short season. We run from Memorial Day to Labor Day, and that's about it. So we just cannot afford downtime. So if someone were to take a boat out and, you know, bend a prop, rip a rudder off, something along those lines, and that puts a boat out of commission for a week, two weeks, three weeks, um, that could potentially mess up a bunch of other reservations. So that is why that's just not an option for us. Having people that are experienced running these boats, stuff is still gonna break, but it takes out a lot of those variables of having complete strangers running your stuff that um, that could be booked out back to back for you know possibly weeks at a time if it's July or August. Those are some of the reasons that uh, experiences are better than straight up rentals for us.